Yo, what's going on Leaf Nation? It's Leafer back again and welcome back to the channel. Today we are back with Monopoly Hut number seven, I believe, dude. We're rolling through the series and today we got some homework to catch up on pretty much, man. So let's get right into it. So looking here, we do have our Hut Rivals rewards available, which is great. We get one player's pack, one prime pack. It isn't great. We didn't finish too well last week, so we got to do better there in terms of getting free packs. Uh, looking at the content that's out right now, we got an 88 primetime Matthews, 86 Couturier, 86 Caprizov. Uh, we got a pretty decent team of the week, 88 Barkov, 87 Huberto, uh, Tarasenko, Sveshnikov, Hamilton, um, and then, you know, the Halloween rivals. So let's head into the store and let's see what we can get. So a prime pack isn't the greatest and the player's pack isn't the greatest either, man. Uh, so we'll go with a prime pack. 10 items, I think we get 3 gold players, something like that, Zach Eston Reese, um, okay, anything else in here, we did pull a purple for the first time last episode, which was absolutely huge, I don't think we're going to top that in these packs, unfortunately, Corpus Allo and Eller is decent, but they won't make the team, alright, and a players pack, 10 items, all players, 5 gold players, and 180 plus overall, not the greatest packs, like I said, so, I'm not expecting too much from them, but hey, you never know. We get an Arendelle. That's that's our 80 plus. That's interesting. We got a Capo Caco. Again, doubt he makes the team. Uh, Jack Johnson. And that's it. None of these guys are going to make the team. But guess what? We get to go to the uh, board, roll the dice, and hope for some good packs. All right, guys. So looking at the board here, last time we left off, we were on one premium pack. So we're right next to roll again. Uh, we can get a roll again. We can get a couple packs, upgrade set, maybe special packs. I think that's six there. So if we can get a six, that'd be huge. So here we go. Rolling for the first time this episode. And we get a six. Okay. Six is special packs what a time to be alive we're opening up special packs oh my goodness okay guys we are on random uh, number generator.org right now we are going to randomize it twice since we get two special packs one through seven all right we're hoping for a five that is the best pack that's out there right now so let's generate it twice first pack is going to be number one so it's going to be a 50k pack and pack number two is going to be a six okay so a one is a haunted starter pack, 16 items, including a power up collectible and two guaranteed 80 plus overalls. The power up collectible is huge. And then we get a six, so that's four, five, six. It's a mega pack, 480 pluses. So we're gonna start with the haunted starter pack here. See what player we can get from here. I think we get one or two 80 plus overalls from this pack. So Lazon's not gonna help us out there. Brady Shea, don't think he's gonna help us out to be honest. Brandon Montour, uh, okay. We get a purple. It's and Andre Vasilevsky. Two back-to-back -back episodes. We're pulling a purple. Vasilevsky's huge because if we were to end up getting his X Factor, we have his base card so we can upgrade him fully. Um, that's huge. We'll take a Vasilevsky. It looks like Freddy is off uh, and out of the way. I think Vasilevsky is going to be our new starting netminder. That is a huge pull. There's our power-up collectible. I did not expect to pull a purple in this pack. If I'm going to be completely honest with you guys, I did not expect it. We get a Vasilevsky. We will definitely take that. Um, yeah, that's another purple, man. We we will take it. Welcome. Welcome to the team. And then the next pack is this mega pack. Uh, I want to look at the odds here. We get a 6% at an 86 plus. That ain't the highest. We get four 80 plus overalls out of this pack. 15 gold players, which is nice. So let's see what we can get here. Uh, something good. I mean, can we get another purple? Back-to-back -back packs? Back-to-back -back purples? I don't know. We get a Mika Zabinijad, who we already have. Um... I'm going to contemplate either selling him or keeping him for future um, sets. Um, so that's not bad. We get an Eric Johnson, Daniel Carr, Brian Rust, um, a team of the week, McSorley. Don't think he'll make the team in, um, but okay, let's keep it going here. We get a coach. Uh, come on. Something else would be nice. I don't think we're going to get anything else, but you never know. Capo Caco, not too bad. Swordstrom. Brandon Gallagher, anything else here? No, that is it. So not too bad. Um, I think the only upgrade we made might have been the Vasilevsky. There's a Binage as nice. We're, uh, I'm not sure what we're going to do with him. I might keep him for Seth. I think that's the smarter thing to do, to be honest. So the only upgrade we made was um, the Vasilevsky. Freddy's done so well for us, though, man. Three games, two wins, one loss. He has a one goals against average and a 90 save percentage. We're going to keep Freddy in there until he fails. But it's nice to know we have Vasilevsky um, to replace him with. So, no upgrades. We pull a purple. 
Let's just head into the first game of the episode here. First game of the episode, 91 Drew, 90 McDavid, 91 Matthews. This guy's team is absolutely cracked. I'm gonna cry. All right, let's see what happens here. Let's see if we can get Panarin his final upgrade possibly. See if we can get uh, Connor some more upgrades. He's fallen behind on the upgrade department. So let's see what we can do here. Christopher Latang coming in. This is my first Huck game in what feels like a long ass time. So let's see how this goes, man. Sabinajad, good hit. Out in front, Kyle Connor was looking for that upgrade. Couldn't get it. Don't know where this puck is. He somehow came out with that, and we're in on a two-on-one. Not good. We're going to cover that. Oh, that, that would have been dirty. That sauce would have been actually dirty. That's fine. Need a hit from Hedman here. We couldn't get one. And Freddy is not off to a good start. Vasilevsky's creeping up behind him, man. That was one of the weakest shots I've seen. 88 primetime OV, so makes sense. That's one that Freddy's got to have, man. I, I feel like you need to have this one, Fredward. I don't know, man. That's a little weak for me. That's fine. I'm not too worried, man. I feel like I feel like we should be fine against this guy. But he does have a really good team. That's the only thing that really worries me. Right, we're not coming out with that, yeah. That's a good poke. I need someone to pick up this puck. Thank you. Marquist over to Brady Kachuk here. Good move. No one's with him, though. Bad line change, but it's fine. There you go, Rasmus Anderson. You're fine, buddy. Get that in front. Patterson. Oh, my good. Good try is what I meant to say. Kachuk. Brady Kachuk puts it in. It's a 1-1 hockey game. I couldn't speak English there. I probably sound like a moron. It's okay because it's a 1-1 hockey game. There goes Abinajad. Take it up, buddy. Connor. And that's an upgrade for Kyle Connor. We love to see it. The puck just bounce to him somehow. I'm not complaining. I will take it. Kyle Connor gets an upgrade. Things you'll love to see. How did this get to him is what I want to know. You know, he, his player, Hedman, just kind of lost the puck, spinned it to him, and Connor just pounces on it. We love that. No, Konechny just kind of moved off the boards for some reason. Got a boy Patterson. Need a good bump. There you go, PD. That's going to get through, and that's going to be a goal with 4.4 to go. What is, what is this game? This game feels so sloppy. Like both ends. I'm I like both ends. It's been a sloppy game, and I absolutely hate it. End of one. It's a two-two hockey game. I, I I don't know, man. This game's felt so weird. It's an even game. It's an even game. It's anyone's game to take right now. I think I said game about twenty-five times in that that one clip. There we go, Artemi. There you go. Good stuff. The bread man to Brad Marchand, and that's going to be a goal. The McGregor, Sully, I'm so good at it too. Me and Brad Marchand are basically twins. I, I I regret saying that. We're not. Anyways, it's a 3-2 hockey game. Great pass from Panarin. Great finish from Brad Marchand. Things you love to see, man. D to D. Give Victor Hedman a goal. He doesn't mind. Brad Marchand, good try, buddy. I'm actually a big fan of Marchand's card this year. I didn't think I would be. Hedman again. Oh, that tip from Pedersen. Nice try, man. Patrick Hornquist. Sean Monahan. Back over to Hornquist. Oh, that's a good block. Oh, no, that's not good D for me. Block, good block from Vadanen. Need a hit. Attaboy, Vaddy. Oh, that's a goal. Freddy has been so bad this game. That is, he got faked so hard on that backhand shot. I think next episode, I not ex episode. I think next game, man. We are we are getting rid of Freddy. He quit. I don't know why he quit. He tied the game up. I think he quit. It wasn't my internet. We weren't lagging. Did we get the win for that? We did end up getting the win for that. I I don't know what I just played. My brain hurts from trying to comprehend what I just played. We'll take it. A win's a win. Um, yeah, man. I I think we're gonna get rid of Freddy, man. He did. He just played horrible that game, man. I was not a fan of him. Uh, quickly look in here. Kyle Connor does get an upgrade, which is huge. And looking at Freddy, a 625, man. Um, I should have changed Joe last game, buddy, and we're going to do it now. I've been promoted to Division 5. I don't like this game. Stop promoting me. I don't want to go any higher, please. So quickly here, Kyle Connor did get an upgrade after scoring a goal. We have him up to an 81. That's 1,000 coins. That's nothing. We'll take that. 81 Kyle Connor, which is nice. Um, what synergy can he, can he get anything activated? Buzzing is close, so we'll keep him on buzzing. That's nice. 
And then looking at goaltending, um, Freddy, I'm sorry, man. I was just not a fan of that. We're going to throw in Vasilevsky, man. Try him out uh, since we did get to uh, pull him. And um, yeah, so the team's looking better. Connor got another upgrade. We completed an objective here, which we're going to quickly see what that's all about. Uh, win one game. Nice. We did win. And uh, now it's back to the board. Okay, so last roll was the beautiful special packs roll. We're looking for something decent here. We got premium packs. Buy any player would be nice. Uh, let's see what we can get here. So rolling for the second and final time this episode. And we get a four. So four is open up one premium pack. I, man, I, these premium packs just pain me because I know we're not going to pull anything here, man. Regardless of packs a pack, let's head to the store, man. One premium pack. I mean, you, you, I guess you just never know, but like, let's be realistic here. We're not going to pull anything, man. So let's see. Even if we pull an X Factor player, like it'd be nice to pull an X Factor player. They're like, what? 74s over overalls, man. High as 77. So you never know. We get a Victor Rask. Not a fan of that um all right we get a penguins player which won't get used and that's about it so like i said these premium packs are horrible we're just gonna pretend that didn't even happen and just head into the second game of the episode here second and final game of the episode gretzky mcdavid kucherov he has wayne gretzky welcome to div 5 monopoly hut oh my god all right he's got crosby too this is vasilevsky's debut i'm kind of happy we switched him out especially after playing a god squad like this i don't see this going well man but let's see how this let's just see how this goes man this is the first time i'm playing gretzky like even on my main account i've yet to play a gretzky and i'm happy uh my monopoly account is going to be the first time i'm trying this card out so this 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 is not going to be a fun time mika what did i lose that puck on ah oh, dude my small players there you go marchand take the shot buddy nice try we're we're working him i don't th this guy's got a god squad i don't think he's the greatest player though i'm just saying Got it in, across, Brady Kachuk, that was the easiest goal of my life. I'm telling you, this guy's got a god squad, he ain't the greatest dog, I'm not I'm not scared anymore. I'm not scared. Oh, oh my god, are we gonna get a rage quit? Before anything, 90 foot, 91 Yager, 91 Crosby, 86 Kane, 88 Hedman, 90 Gretzky, base McKinnon, 89 McDavid, 91 Matthews, 89 Pugliarvi, and the 88 Rask. Dude, my god. Poke from Verhage. Good stuff. We're on a little bit of a break here. Sauce it over. Oh my god. Over to Anderson. And that is a deflection that you love to see. Pavel Buchnevich tipping that puck from Rasmus Anderson. It's a 2 0 hockey game. Like I said, I'm not scared. I'm not scared anymore. Don't let him shoot. Oh, horrible defense, man. I said I'm not scared, but like realistically, dude, any of these cards you can shoot it with and they're probably going to go in. Like, look at these cards. Now, yo, screw that noise, man. I'm not scared. Good goal. Fair enough. We're fine. Let's go, boys. That gets across. That's insane. Wayne Gretzky scores. And just like that, all the momentum we have is just thrown out the window. I'm... Oh, this is Div 5 hockey, man. That's insane. We couldn't just get out of that period. He's, oh my God. Look at these stats, man. It's not like I'm getting out work. He just took two shots with his good players and they're going to go in because they're Gretzky and I don't even know who scored the first one. I, I'm a little frustrated. There you go. Good pass. Let's go, Petey. Saucer. What a saucer pass, dude. What an actual saucer pass. Oh my God. No, Rasmus Anderson is flat-footed. Good goaltending for me. I got to do everything around here. And where's my team? Where is my team? What a save from Vasilevsky. Holy God, man. Really got me there, buddy. Go, Marchand. Bang. Brad Marchand. Dude, I'm, I'm actually... I really enjoy using his huck card. It's a 3-2 hockey game. Screw this guy because he is not good and he should not be in this game whatsoever. I'm, I'm going to say it. And it too is a 3-2 hockey game. It's only a 3-2 hockey game. Look at these stats. Here you go, Pedersen. Oh my god, we're in. Across. Oh, off the post. I'm, I'm not happy about that one. Bang. Okay, now we're getting just robbed. Good poke from Anderson, dude. I really enjoy Rasmus Anderson. Sean Monaghan. 
Beautiful. Bang. There it is. That was just... That was dirty. That was dirty. Oh my god, that was beautiful. Sean Monaghan. Beautiful. 4-2 hockey game. We re regain our two-goal lead. You love to see it. Absolutely love to see it. Alright, now we're playing stupid. That's a good poke. And that, that somehow trickles through Vasilevsky. That, that is on me. I'm playing stupid. Going between the legs with an 81 Vadanin. But with that being said, I don't think that should go in. Vasilevsky should have that one. It's 50-50. Good poke. That's a goal. Good save. Hedman didn't get that puck. And that's a goal I hate. <sighs> we're fine. I'm, I, we're fine. We're fine. We're fine. It's it's so annoying that I got to play teams like this in Div 5. In all honesty, it's super annoying. Bang. Oh, my God. That, that really. Patterson. That's a poke and a half, dude. I, I hate that we're going overtime. I do not agree that we're going overtime whatsoever. And these stats just go to show you why they should not be going overtime. I'm doubling, almost doubling his time on attack. Literally three seconds off doubling his time on attack. And and it's it's a four four hockey game. This is fun. Oh, this isn't good. That was bad defense for me. Don't let him shoot. My God. I I can't believe that got through. I like I I actually cannot believe that pass just got through. And that's how I lose a hockey game. I'm so, um, ah, that's so undeserved. Almost in gold ranking, which is nice. If we won that, we would have been in gold ranking. Looking at these stats, man. I, I don't know how I lose a game like this. Um, you know how I how I lose a game like this? And we're getting a message from him. That has to hurt. Alright. Well, Buddy literally spent his bank account um, on the game. So I'm going to tell him to go spend more of his mom's money. Um, looking at our team stats. I don't think we got any upgrades, if I'm not mistaken. Um, but Rasmus Anderson had himself one hell of a game. Hornquist played great. Marshawn played great as usual. Minus two doesn't really reflect how he played. And Vasilevsky, not not a great first game, to be honest, man. But, like, I, I can't really blame him. Relegation warning. Yes, please. Throw me back in Div 6. Please. If that's what I'm going to be playing in Div 5, throw me back to Div 10. I could care less. Anyways, guys, that's going to be it for today's Monopoly HUD episode. I think we should have went 2-0 today, but the second game went how it went. It is what it is. It happens. It, you can't win every game. Plain and simple. But anyways, guys, like I said, that is it for today's video. If you guys did enjoy it, be sure to drop a like on it. If you guys are new around here, make sure to hit the subscribe button down below. We upload three times a week here on the channel. So if you guys want to see more content, be sure to hit the sub button down below. But like I said, that is it for today's video. Thank you guys very much for watching, and I'll talk to you guys later. Peace!